everyone. I'm here to give my three months review of the PSP. Uh, it's been a pretty good past three months of this PSP, and uh, it's, I haven't had really any any major problems with it. I've gone through about four firmware upgrades by now, and uh, I have five games and three movies now, and I'm really enjoying it. It's been a good buy. Uh, I especially right now I'm using it more as a music player, really, but I just got some interesting games. Um, really, the the memory stick that I bought, the 4 gigabyte memory stick, has really been a uh, I'm glad I bought it because it's really it's really been a good thing to have because it's helped me to use the PSP to the max because I can really just put just put some DVD rips and put a lot of music on there so it's it's really nice and uh, I have two different cases I this is an older case that I have and then my Playgear Pocket it's pretty nice it saved my PSP a few times when I dropped it so actually I haven't dropped the PSP yet but it's it's saved it from a few scratches so it's pretty good. I had a wrist strap on here for a little while, then I took it off because it, it kind of got in the way. And uh, I know this is on firmware 3.52 now, and I'm kind of wishing I'd sit on 3.5 so I could use the Lumines to downgrade to 1. Point, to, to run the, the homebrew enabler and then downgrade to 1.5 and then upgrade to 3.40 OEA. But I guess I'll just stick with uh, official firmware and see if there's anything interesting in the future, which there probably won't be, which is probably a mistake to update, but oh well. Um, so basically, it's it's a pretty good device. It's it's held up over these past three months. Uh, I haven't had any problems with it really. Just a few. It's it's frozen a few times, crashed a few times during a load, and um, that's about all really. It's a, it's a very nice device, and I'd suggest that if you're thinking about buying one, go ahead and buy it, or wait till September for the new PSP Lite to come out. Uh, thanks for watching.